Hey guys, what's up? I'm going to power up both of these laptops. This is a Windows 10 machine. This is a Windows 8.1 and I'm going to upgrade it to 10 because I kind of like it. But for me, I don't always want my computer's password protected. As a DJ, I may have an assistant who's working with me. They may need to get into the computer. I know there's an administrative mode where you can have limited access to your computer, but I may want somebody to have all access to my computer. You can see this machine. You gotta type the password in. This one, you didn't have to. There's a cool thing that you can do to avoid this whole password thing in the regular administrative mode. I'm gonna show you how to do it right now. It's pretty easy. Now, I'm pretty sure this works with eight. I know it works with 8.1 and 10. So you turn on your computer like you always do. This one's a little slow. It's a small little notebook that I bought for travel that I will be updating to Windows 10 soon. All right, now we're gonna type in our password like we always do. All right, enter. And everything opens up. Now what we're gonna do, as soon as this thing is done booting, a little circle goes away. We're gonna come down to this Windows icon in the lower left and right click. Select run. Now in this little box right here you're going to type this N E T P L W I Z and press OK. Now there's a bunch of stuff here that comes up. There's a little box here. It says users must enter a username and password to use this computer. Untick this box. Then hit apply. Now this is going to come up. It's going to ask you to type in your password. And confirm password. and press OK. Alright, let's test it out. Let's shut the computer down and see what happens. It's taking a minute. Okay. Now, let's go ahead and turn it on and watch. Ta-da! So I hope this video helps someone. For those of you who don't want to type your password in every time, for whatever reason, that's how you get around it. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment section. I'll do my best to answer them. I'm not a computer guy, but I did Google this and I found this and I thought it was pretty helpful and thought I'd share it with you. I'm gonna upgrade this machine to Windows 10. Practice and enjoy.